Hello and how are you? Hey friends, welcome to the Shed Show. I am your host, Shannon Doyle Briscoe. Coming to you live right here in St. Charles, Missouri. Hey, this here is Tuesday, September 13th, 2016. B blog number 983. Actually, I have no idea what number it is. I was looking through my records. I've got three V blog number uh, three twenty three uh, sixty twos and a bunch of three twenty three twenty fours and so who knows what V blog it is. But it, we're going with uh, nine eighty three. All right, all right. Hey, speaking of September thirteenth. One day, there was a young man born way back in, well, way back in the waybacks, and uh, he became a, he became a uh, young man, and then he be- married a wife, and that wife, his name, oh, his name was John, he married a wife named Mary, and they begot a son named Cimarron, then they begot a son named Shenandoah, and well, that man would be my dad, John Briscoe. But that date was September 13th. And so here we go. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear daddy. Happy birthday to you. And many more. All righty then. That being said. Oh, uh, we got a whole mess of things coming up uh, in Augusta, which is not too awful far from here. Uh, they got the Augusta Harvest Festival. That's right. The event will start on the 15th, which will be uh, this weekend, um, and it'll run through the 18th. The event will begin Thursday with a pop-up art gallery at the American Legion Hall from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m., and then spend the evening at the Augusta Trailhead, where Pop, Papa Wheelie and the Augusta Brewery will perform. All righty. All righty. Hey, and then um, also this weekend, we got the Mosaic of Missouri Art Festival, or Festival of the Arts, and that'll be down on Main Street. That'll be the 16th through the 18th. Down on Main Street here in St. Charles, Missouri, a historic Main Street of St. Charles, Missouri. Several blocks of, blocks of the North Main Street in historic St. Charles will pay host to more than 75,000 people at the 22nd Annual Mosaic Missouri Festival of the Arts on September 16th through 18th. This is free. Free, free, free. So come on in and enjoy, enjoy. All righty, what else is going on? That thing, That's going to run for three days. River City Rascals are uh, in the play- championship playoffs out there in, uh, Wins- or in O'Fallon at the uh, T.R. Hughes Boulevard there at uh, Car Shield Field. So, get out there. Uh, we are headed to our sixth championship series in the last eight years. Can you believe that game three and four for the series will be played at Car Shield Field this coming Friday and Saturday? Purchase your tickets now. All righty. And then on the... Um, I guess it would be the 16th. Harvest Festival uh, keeps going. And then on the 17th, uh, ooh, they got the MMA fights going on down there at the uh, um, St. Charles Arena, I do believe. Yep, the family arena. Now, that's a paid event. So n- normally, you know how it is. I don't normally... Uh, uh, talk about the paid events, but if you're into MMA uh, fighting, then you might want to catch that fight hard MMA September 17th, 2016 at the Family Arena. Alrighty, and then the Mosaic Art Festival continues. And how about oh, 
Let's see here. How about Pioneer Days? On September 17th, 2016 through the 18th, uh, recurring daily, the historical Daniel Boone Home at, at Lindenwood Park, historic Daniel Boone Home Heritage Center, out on Highway F in Defiance, Missouri. Uh, the historic Daniel Boone Home uh, comes to life during Pioneer Days. This two-day fun family event allows you to set, step back in time to learn about the Missouri frontier. Come out and enjoy, enjoy, enjoy. I do believe it's a free event, of course. Come out and play Pioneer Games, listen to old-time music, join in the fun of period dance, throw an, an, an atlan, atlatl, which is a big uh, big stick, I believe. Looks like a telephone pole, only part of it, only small, smaller. Uh, experience what life was like in the frontier villages. Guests of... Guests can tour the Daniel Boone home and have the opportunity to meet Daniel Boone himself, along with biographer John Filson. Then take a stroll through the auth and through an authentic general store on the park property and watch exciting cannon demonstrations performed by the militia de San Carlos. Other demonstrations including blacksmithing, historic surveying, Dutch oven cooking, pottery, uh, carpentry, town, a town ball, and crafts. So be sure to stop by the, the children's village for some tomahawk throwing, hay mazes, candle dipping, pie eating contests, tug of war tournaments, sack races, and other period games. So... Come on out there, it's $10 for adults and $8 for seniors, children 6 and under, oh, uh, $6 for children, and 4 and under are free. Alrighty, alrighty, find yourself out there at uh, Historical Daniel Boone Heritage Center. Alright, that being said, what else is going on? I think that's about it. Yep, 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 yep. That's about it. Okay. So, now, there is something else I wanted to look up, and hopefully it's in. If it is, I got a commercial for you. I hope, I hope, I hope. Um, I'm not seeing it. Somebody forgot me today. Nope. I didn't get it, so I can't run their commercial. Went out and had my car inspected today at Fred's, uh, Fred's, Fred's, Fred's. Well, they used to be Fred's, uh, Fred's Fair Muffler. But now they're Fred's Complete Auto Care Center. That's what they are now. Um, the one I went to is on located at First Capital in West Clay, across from the uh, Coverance Bank, and uh, go out there and talk to Chris. Get all your car automobile needs done and taken care of. I just had mine inspected today, but they uh, were kind enough to put it up on a rack and take a look at some other parts because uh, it's been dragging because of the low um, suspension on it due to the... Uh, Handicap, um, whatchamacallit, the, uh, retro fix. So whenever they rehabbed it for the handicapped equipment, they had to lower it even lower than the regular lowered floor because it's a, uh, it's a uh, Dodge Grand Caravan Stow and Go. So that means the floor is lowered already because you just flip your seats down into the floor and there they go. Uh, but in this case, they even uh, lowered it even further. Or actually, they added a thing onto the bottom of it, which is where the slide ramp comes out of. So, 
Anyway, I went in to get it inspected for my emissions inspection, since it's a 2012, so it only had the emissions. But I also had them uh, do me another favor and take a look at, see what I was dragging on, and check out some other issues. And so they did, and I will, and they're going to be getting it back for some more work. So just remember, fares is complete. Uh, Fred's Complete Automotive Care over there, uh, Automotive Care Center over there across from the Commerce Bank on First Capital Drive. Just after King's Highway on First Capital. Alrighty then. Hey, that being said, uh, I wanted to sing a song today, but I can't remember what song it was, so may not be singing today. I'm sure I could think of it. No. I don't think I can. I was singing a lot today. And I did not get to singing what it was I wanted to sing. Met some fine folks out there. Uh, Fred's. Well, Chris, by the way, he's the uh, pretty much office manager, whatever you want to call him. He's the desk clerk. He gets everything aligned up and gets everybody associated with what they're getting ready to do. He's the garage manager. That's what he is. So you go out there and you talk to Chris and he'll get you hooked up. Okay? Well, alrighty then. Oh, lordy, lordy, lordy. Don't forget, um, uh, it'll be next, next week. Not this week, but. Next week, I think the 22nd, maybe, or the 23rd, I don't know, I don't remember what day it is, but um, Main Street, Music on Main, will have Butch Wax and the Sundance, uh, Butch Wax, yeah, Butch Wax. And the, uh, what are they? Can't remember. I used, I, I've got a t-shirt. The only reason I got a t-shirt is because, well, we won a contest. Me and my kids was dancing out in my wheelchair and just dancing around and, and around and around. And we got the t-shirt to prove that we was good dancers. Yes, we did. Dance competition. Anyway, um, that being said, looks like it's about time for our portion of the program called Our Daily Bread. So, I'm going to go ahead and kick that off for you. Today's devotional is called Ready for a Change. Become an autumn, you know that the leaves are falling from the trees. And well, that just lets a the butterflies come out of their cocoons and get ready to spread their wings and fly uh, south, I imagine, where it's warm. And uh, and anyway, the leaves are changing. They're going to be falling, falling from the trees, cluttering up the yards. But that's okay. Anyway, we're going to be reading Galatians. Well, I'm going to be reading Galatians uh, 5, 16 through 25. And if you're keeping up with your Bible in a year, go to Proverbs 16 through 18 and then 2 Corinthians 6. Alrighty. Alrighty then. Here we go. Galatians 15 through 25. Or Galatians 15, 16 through 25. But I say, walk by the Spirit, and you will not carry out the desires of the flesh. For the flesh sets its desires against the spirit, and the spirit against the flesh. For these are the opposition of one, to one another. So, you may not do the things that you please, but if you are led by the spirit, you are not under the law. Now the deeds of the flesh are evident, which are immorality, impurity, sensuality, idolatry, idolatry, uh, sorcery, enmities, strife, jealousy, 
outbursts of anger, disputes, dis decision, dis dissensions, uh, factions, envying, drunkenness, carousing, and things like these, of which I forewarn you, just as I have forewarned you, that those who practice such things will not inherit the kingdom of God. But the fruit of the Spirit is love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, self-control. Against such things there is no law. Now, those who belong to Christ Jesus have crucified the flesh with its passion and desires. So if we live by the Spirit, let us also walk by the Spirit. Well, there you have it. That sounds like a good little uh, thing to remember there. That passage there is a good passage to remember. Galatians five sixteen through 25. That'll keep you walking on the straight and narrow path, I'm telling you. All right, anyway, that being said, let's go ahead and wrap her up. I'm going to say, well, goodbye, my friends. It's time to go. I said, goodbye, my friends, it's time to go. I hate to leave you, but I really must go. Goodbye, my friends, goodbye. Well, this is Shenandoah Briscoe saying hello and how are you. Thanks for tuning in to the Shen Show. And you know, as always, God loves you and so do I. So be blessed in Jesus' name and come back and see me tomorrow. Because, well, I'll be here and I hope you are too.